Amelia, why are you doing showing up to my tea party like this? Since you're here, why don't you have some cheesecake, baka? And have a cup of tea. Suspicious squad, this is Mr. Suspicious. I hope you're having a wonderful day. I not only have one, but two figures to be unboxing that I've been waiting for two months for, and I'm super excited. Let's get started. Two figures I'm unboxing is the Million Ekadana from the Katakawa Tea Set Party. Let's get started with the Ekadana. I got Ekadana from Otaku Mode for about a hundred and something. Seventy something dollars. And here's their little folder I got. And their branded box, well protected, like usual. So let's check her out. Let's free her from the bubble wrap. Time to free her from the box, and here is the box. And let's free her from the box. And let's go free her from the blistering. And here's a first look of the figure. Plain white base. And her chair. And here is the chair. Here's the figure herself. Let's go free Amelia from the box. I've been waiting for months to unbox her because I was waiting for the Ekandana to come in. And I bought her from Amazon Japan for like 250. Here's the box. Let's go free her from her packaging.
attempt to free her from the blister thing. And we have a table. A white face. And time to give them the chair. And another white base. And Amelia herself. And here is the table. And here is the chair. Here is Emilia herself. Here is Emilia with all her accessories. Here's Ekadana again. Time for my thoughts and opinions. I think Amelia is slightly better as a figure than the Ekadana in the set because her shoes are touching the ground. And that's not saying Ekadana is a bad figure, she's probably just as good, but I wish that her foot was touching the ground. But I heard other users have the same issue with the Ekadana. For watching this video, please consider leaving a like, comment, and subscribe. And I hope to see you guys soon. Bye.